mental skills, laws of the game, spirit of the game. And we're obviously looking to bring all of that alive within our coaching programming, you know, making sure that the player is at the centre of it at the entire time and the individual. And every individual, as you know, are very different in terms of how they are, where, what stage of learning they're at um, with their own development. We have that strap line. Better people, better players, better grades. And you'll you probably notice that two out of three um, have nothing to do with football. So there's only the one better players, which is football related. The other two are better people and better grades and better education. Um, you know, has nothing to do with what they actually do on, on a football pitch. And that's important to us that we're not just developing them as footballers, but we're developing them as well-rounded, respectable individuals. When we, we've had a new head teacher come in at the school that we work in partnership with, and one of the first things he commented to me was, was the respect that our boys showed him when they first met him from a simple handshake, eye contact, different things like that. So that's important to us that we're, we're developing you know, good individuals and the boys that have come through the program, we think, you know, that, that they're the ones that when, we, when you talk to them and you really get to know them, that they're, they're well-rounded young, young men. 